Hello, ladies and gentlemen, I'm happy and welcome back to the Witcher 3 expansion pack Hearts of Stones. And probably today is the last episode because I don't think that this DLC is going to be that long. So I marked fast traveling point on the map and I will fast travel to meet Olgird because that's what I need to do. Because I completed his last wish. I got like Rose or something. Yeah, that's how we got in in the first place. Okay, get him out of here. Yeah, and the music suddenly changed. I like that mysterious music, but okay, whatever. Yep, but actually this happy music is cool too, you know, after a little while when you get used to that mysterious music, it's cool too. So, okay, I'll fast travel here and I'll see you at the Olgierd's place, I guess. Okay, we fast traveled only like 40 meters to meet Olgierd and I don't know, actually I'm not prepared to end this game, actually this DLC in this episode, because I don't know what will I say about this game. I know that it's a fucking almost pure perfection. I have a few thoughts about this game. That are not like 10 out of 10, that are like 9 out of 10, 8 out of 10, so... Two points, yeah. and be but... quick about it. Oh, please, good sir, a bit of courtesy. So I look up, and Bob's your uncle. He downs half the barrel in one draft. Mm -mm. Okay, so where is... Geralt, Olgier? over here! Okay, that's not Olgier, this is like... Oi, how I call him looks. devil. Use the look of a man who knows how to drink. Thanks. Some other time. Hey now, don't make me beg. More treats. Oh. I get the goosebumps. That sound effect. All everything is so mysterious. All is mysterious. Everything is mysterious. What the fuck? Show off. Of course I am. Wouldn't you be? And Time's he's just a like, marvelous plaything. And a great cool. spice to use in gingerbread. Okay. So, you were listening. Indeed, occasionally I find time manipulation irresistible. Controlling it offers so many appetizing opportunities. Like spiking the soup of unsavory individuals with appropriately ghastly things. <laughs> okay, who are you really? I'm pretty sure he is devil like I said when I say he's not from this world We know that there are more worlds when we play like the original Witcher 3 I don't know what to explain. I don't know how to say something. I don't know where he's from I know that he's not that simple, but maybe everything is simpler than it looks. Okay, let's who are you really? Gauntor Odin also known not what I'm asking Ah, So you'd rather know what it is I do in brief, I give folk what they ask for. You might say, I simply grant their wishes. Uh, and get them into trouble. Yeah, awful noble of you. So yeah, when I say, yeah, awfully noble of you, it sounds even worse. So I guess I'll go with this one and get them into trouble. And drop them in a world of hurt. No, not I. That would be their poorly formulated wishes. I'm no cheat. I give folk what they want, nothing more. That the off desire unworthy things, that is entirely the fault of their rotten natures. You're not human, that's clear. So what are you? A demon? A djinn? Do you I really wish to know? Yes, yes, yes. Yes. No, okay. Geralt, you don't. This one time I shall spare you and not grant your wish. All no. who heard my true name are now either dead or have met an even worse fate. Yet I still need you. You control time or is this just some trick? Mm -mm. I wanna know who the fuck he is, but okay, whatever. Gonna go through all the dialogues and probably I should like spare the game, have the fun with the game, like investigate all the dialogues and everything. I mean, I already do this, but still I have to pay closer attention because I'm pretty sure the game is really close to ending. If not in this episode and then the next one, but Whatever. You actually control time, or is this just some conjurer's trick? What difference does it make? A big one. Hmm. Let us say, time has always fascinated me. So, I taught myself how best to use it. Why time, of all things? Geralt, there are four dimensions. Length, width, height, and time. What would you have me fall in love with? Width? Come now. <laughs> okay, <laughs> okay, why are you even here? So, to what do I owe the pleasure? 
I wanted to congratulate you. You acquitted yourself splendidly with all geared. In fact, you've almost satisfied your Almost? Death. Was supposed to fulfill his three wishes. Did just that. This is where you remove the brand, because we're even. Nearly. To fulfill the terms of the contract to the letter, you must do one more thing. Draw all gear to the temple of Ilvani. We never discussed that. Oh, but we did. As a man of the world, you should know that every contract contains a catch or two. Small print, which, nevertheless, changes the ultimate meaning of the pact. This applies to oral contracts as well. Recall that I said, and I quote, I believe, however, that all will end well, and once it does, we three shall meet and thank one another for the voyage we shared. End quote. Mm, yeah, I remember. Then we shall improvise. I believe, however, that all will end well, and once it does, we three shall meet and thank one another for the voyage we shared. Right. Specifics now. Fulfill your end of the bargain, and I will remove the brand. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, he is really devil. I think he is real devil. That was the last time you interrupted me while I was talking to someone. What the devil? Why is there a fly in my soup? I was waiting. I had an eye out for you. Didn't see you come in. How is it you're here? I'm quick, real quick. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna be dead. I'm a witcher. Superhuman quickness. Just one of my many qualities. You tossed this fly in my suit? No. Now listen carefully. Tell your Ataman to come to the Temple of Lilvani. It's south of here. Entrance is inside a cave. <coughs> What's the commotion? Lilvani's temple, got it? Aye, got it. Hold yep. that! Your friend, the medic, she were here. Ask that you look in on her. Thanks. Okay, so probably I should go and meet Shiny now. So this is probably a side quest before. Yeah, talk to Shiny at her home. Whatever, definitely gonna go and talk to Shiny. And me, maybe, probably, I... All of those who stick with me throughout all this game, right? It's not the ending, but... And I'm not referring, and I'm not talking it's like the ending, but I just want to say a few things about the game, what I think, because I'm not sure that I will be able to end and say my last words at the end of the game. So, what I want to say now is that the only thing I did that wasn't like 10 out of 10 is like the weddings, because they were like a little bit too long, weddings were too long. Yeah, they could have been like an hour shorter, you know? Okay, whatever. Yeah, now we're gonna go and talk to Shani, and maybe she's gonna give me, like, a side quest. And I'm definitely gonna do side quests because what I learned from the original Witcher 3, that side quests here, especially side quests with women here, were really fucking great, right? Like, side quests with Trist, where you had to help her. Like, with Yennefer, where you had to do, like, the shit with Jin or something like that. Yeah, now we're gonna talk to Shani and guess we're gonna get something interesting here as well. But isn't that the house where... No, this is not the house. I thought this is the same house where Triss Marigold was. Okay. Whatever, okay, here Shani. she is. Oh, Geralt, good thing you're here. Really? Yep, and that again, the same music. What happened? Somebody break in? This? Oh, no, just... Getting ready to move. What? When? when where to? <sighs> not what I wanted to talk to you about. Or at least not only, but... Mm -hmm. I'm leaving, Geralt. The Eastern Front beckons. I'm Kedwin bound. Learn anything about Olgard? This departure is so sudden, why? Never mentioned you'd be moving. Any intention to, either. I didn't know I would be. Found out this morning. Two soldiers came to my door, said Redania needs me again. Couldn't turn them down? Just say no? Uh, perhaps I could've. But I didn't want to. Treating the ill and wounded, it's my calling. No place I'm needed more than at the front. Don't go, I see. Okay. 
Actually, you know what? I'm really thinking, is there a possibility to end up with Shiny? Because in the original game, I didn't end up with anyone. Like, maybe one day I will replay the third Witcher and then I'm gonna end up with Triss. Because I kinda... They're both like Yennefer and Triss are both great, but I kinda wish to be with Triss in this game. So I think now at this point, when we don't have anyone, I guess we can try to be with Shiny. You know? At least someone. So I'll say like, don't go just for that reason because Geralt now is single, doesn't have anyone, right? Why not Can't make this boy happy? And stay? Geralt, what for? The wedding, the time we've spent together, it was nice. Ah, uh, yeah. But you have your life and she I have just mine. just said... We... This doesn't make sense long term. You know that as well as I do. Well... You take care of yourself. You too, Geralt. Haha, <laughs> she just said to fuck off. Okay, learn anything about Olgierd? So, learn anything about Olgierd? Well, I Great. abandoned the books quickly. Decided that if I was going to learn the truth, I'd need to find someone who knows it. Find anyone? Turned out I didn't need to look far. A colleague at the Academy, an assistant to Professor Pramathine Shakeslock. Claims Olgierd von Everick met with the professor multiple times. What? Apparently, Olgierd asked the professor to do some research. The professor got so worked up doing it, he went daffy. Started jealously guarding his notes. Wouldn't even let his assistant look at them. The professor, where'll I find him? Here in Oxenfurt. Cloistered inside his house on Academy grounds. Mage hunters guard his door. Mage hunters? Why are they at his door? Mage hunters at the door. He under house arrest? I can't say, really. Some of the faculty think him a traitor. Say he sold out to the hunters for a hefty pouch of gold. The assistant, on the other hand, insists the professor wants him there to protect him. I don't know what from. What's your guess? He's certainly useful to them. A specialist in black magic and the occult? Must be a trove of knowledge. If he's really gone off his nutter, I wouldn't be surprised to see them using him. Okay, so need to see this professor. Yeah, I'll go, and I probably think this is gonna be a need side to quest. To this professor. We'll go together. Redanian guards all over the academy. Doubt you'll get in alone. Okay. Guards have never stopped me. You know that. Mm. Wound these, and I'll have to patch them up. Besides, we might run into a friend. Get inside free and easy. Okay. Follow shiny like optional. Okay, it's still optional, and I'll loot her. Why not? I'll loot her room. I'll loot everything. I'll loot everything, and now I'll go with her. And is that it? Yeah, when they say it's optional, I really want to do everything. Get, like, squeeze a lot of this game. Squeeze everything this game can possibly offer to me. Okay, offer me. Here are other, like, side quests. And maybe I will do them when I end, like, the main main story. I'm not sure about that. Why not? I could, like, because this is The Witcher 3. This so is So how are things at the Academy these days? This channel is about. Since Radovid shut it you know? down. I mean, is it well guarded? Might be all it is. Many of the faculty fled to the far north. The braver ones stayed, but assumed the guises of tailors and laundresses. Why? Just curious. Scholars seem to have adopted mage tactics. They in the same bind? To Radovid, there is little difference between the two. Seems to tolerate you well enough. Because he needs me. For now. So, the Eastern Front, and then? Depends where they send me. Wherever it is, take care of yourself. Always do. So don't worry. Yep, okay. This is the end of the talk. Yep, and actually, like I said, this channel is all about The Witcher 3. Not actually all about The Witcher 3, but, you know, I love Witchers because as soon as I end this one, I'm probably gonna grab the second Witcher. The second Witcher is gonna be quite an adventure, too, so... And I'll probably squeeze out everything out of this game. All the side quests and everything. Why not, right? Yeah, so, but I don't think they will be, like, that interesting. Maybe? I don't know. We will see if they won't be interesting. They won't go on the channel, right? But we will see. Witcher 3 is a Holt, great game. By order of King Radovid, no one's allowed inside the academy. Not even lecturers? No one means no one. See, you've become quite the stickler, Norbert. You were much kinder when I was patching you up. By the way, how's your knee? Fine. Dandy. As if no arrow ever struck it. Consider yourself a lucky man. Because if I'd not decided to operate, you'd be a cripple to the end of your days. <clears throat> Bruno? Hey? Maybe we ought to let her in. 
She's a decent lass. Not like to steal nothing. Hmm. All right. But alone. Which will draw too much attention. I'd rather not get chite from the captain on his account. Here's what we'll do. I'll go in, then help you sneak in around the back. Like, they don't hear Ow. that. Don't know, but I'll figure something out. Usually aren't nearly as many guards on the riverside. Agreed. All right. Let me in. Okay. So now what? I enter the academy grounds. Okay, so I have to walk around and do like get from the other side of this building, right? And it's like really weird. She was talking loudly and then she still like spoke really damn loudly and I'm pretty sure they could hear her. Yep, am I going the right way? Yep, now we're gonna go through this thingy thing. Oh, and today I had like weird thought, you know, before I started recording, I had like one little thought. And so I just want to share with my thought here with you. So, okay, the point is, I like kind of compared like, compared like main characters in Skyrim and the third the Witcher and it's all in Witcher. So, the point is what I want to say, basically, Witcher is gonna slay main character in Skyrim. Right? Because Geralt slays dragons, like all those dragons, like griffins or something like that. And in the Skyrim, will I have to be, you spend so much time killing them. Yeah, the point is, Witcher 3 is gonna destroy Skyrim's main character. Yeah, whatever. Don't know why I said that, but why not? Okay, here a drowner is gonna just use the thing. And why not? Why not sneak? Yep. Love fighting here and everything gonna pick up everything from these dudes okay some Geralt. time later Psst. are you there yes yeah, i'm here That's... grab the line line not the rope but line who says line happy is so stupid where'd you, you get the rope anything. <sighs> long story but we've done well professor shakeslock's house is at the end of this street witch hunters guard the door Doubt I'll be able to sweet-talk them. Been a huge help already, Shani. Thanks. It was nothing. Really. You'd have done the same for me. Even more? If you wish to see me again before I go, I'll be at home. Packing will take some time yet. All right. Be seeing you. Okay, whatever. That's great. So she helped me enter. I'm gonna do this because I spent so much time walking to see the professor and all the other things so there's no point to turn back even i don't understand why it still says optional but maybe okay witch hunter okay this weapon may not be that cool but it restores health and pretty damn quickly especially with humans okay i got pretty damn stupid here they almost didn't kill me and i think I should go and meditate. I hope that they're not gonna respawn. Yep, they didn't respawn. I restored thingy things here. It's just like, I still kind of don't get it. They were just guards and I killed them and nothing is gonna happen to Geralt. Okay, I understand it's just a game, but why? Lock uh, tight. Need another way in. You leave a window open, maybe. Okay, got your clue, right? Okay, this shit is locked too, so maybe... Okay, there is a ladder. I see a ladder. ladder. Yeah, there is a ladder. And let's get up there. Yep. Now walking circles. Yep. Don't want to loot like these little boxes because I'm not going to get anything valuable from them. And maybe at the end of the game, I'm going to get like Viper set because I still need like a few more levels, I guess, right? Okay, I see where should I probably go. Oh, 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 oh not here. Let's loot everything here because it's a roof, so they might put something interesting on. Here, right? Um, <laughs> okay, let's just girl go here because I'm pretty sure that's where I need to be. Okay, let's use. Yes, not that dumb after all. Yeah, and now I hear someone sobbing. Okay, and the music is still happy. Shit. Okay, gonna use my torch here torch here actually i wish they added another button for the torch that's what i don't like here but whatever we can't get everything we want Franco, i fell you? leave the bedpan in the usual spot and take the platter i shan't be eating today professor shakeslock who the blazes how'd you get in get out i know nothing don't wish to know anything understand no 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 out 
Not gonna hurt you. That demon sent you. I'm sure of it. Uh, yeah, no one sent me. I'm gonna say the truth, but what demon? Yeah, gonna say that, but actually, that's. But. What demon? Feigned ignorance. <laughs> Please, you know. Gaunter, old dim, evil incarnate. He didn't send me, but he is why I'm here. I'm a witcher. <laughs> a mutant. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Could be. Uh, come to talk. You're a prisoner here? Why are there guards outside your door? You a prisoner? Protective custody. That's the phrase. Protective. <laughs> when I cannot decide my own fate, cannot breathe without their permission. What do they want from you? You may not be aware, but I am one of the foremost experts on the occult. Living experts, that is. My mentor was the outstanding Professor Lionel Van... And you're cooperating with the witch hunters now? Cooperating? <laughs> As if I had a choice. They're ignorant. But not enough to ignore what I know about magic, witches, sorceresses, what have you. Knowledge they use for barbaric ends. But that's beyond my control. So, oh, came to talk, so yeah, let's talk to him. What he's gonna tell me about or Olgier? Came here because I need information. I think you might be the only man who has it. Hmm, a witcher. Then it follows I needn't fear. I'm hardly a post-conjunction creature. What did Olgierd von Everick want from you? And he's just like, fuck. I curse the day I first set eyes upon the man. He appeared at my doorstep one day, offering a sack of gold were I only to find out who Gaunter O'Dim is and how to get rid of him. I agreed. Such matters are my speciality. And I needed the coin. I pored over countless tomes, delved into obscure incidents and analyzed folk legends. I went so far as to travel to Nilfgaard, the library there, where at last I hit upon the mysterious entity's trail. There are records of encounters dating back thousands of years in many cultures under many names, but always as evil incarnate. In this land, we call him Gaunter O'Dim. At times, Master Mirror, or the Man of Glass. In deciphering the ancient scrawlings, I went blind. Yet I learned a great deal. For example, that he plays with his victims. And thrives on pacts above all else. Seemingly harmless contracts, which drive their parties to madness. Okay, our magic circle on the floor, what's that about? Okay, I noticed that, like, fucking pentagram or something like that? What's with the surroundings? These runes, what do they mean? They protect me. Here, evil cannot touch me. How do you know? He told me himself. He paid me a visit once. Fascinating meeting, that was. I was blind already, but saw him clearly. He smiled at me. Said he was honoured I'd taken such an interest in him. He wished to thank me, and explained he'd taken a similar interest in me. He drew the circle and said I'd be safe within it. His way of repaying me, you see. Ever tried to leave it? If you'd heard how he said it, you'd be as certain as I am what leaving would bring. So basically that means he can't leave the circle, or else he's gonna die? Weird. Know anything else about the man? Gaunter O'Dim is no man. He is evil. Evil which assumes various forms. Forget about him or die. You're That's... alive. Alive? Yet I live in constant fear, born of what I've learned about him. Okay, that's what I said in the beginning of the game, I think. He's devil. Evil devil, the same things, right? Olgierd signed one of these pacts with him. Brilliant deduction guessed why. You must know that he came from a wealthy, influential line. He must have, if the family of his betrothed accepted him. Yet did you know, his fortune soured. He himself became an outcast, impoverished. Iris's family, a powerful house, could not accept this, would not marry their daughter to a nobody. Olgierd wished to elope. The further away, the better. Yet Iris refused to cut her family ties. Quite the predicament. Indeed. Their luck turned yet darker 
when a wandering witch mentioned a solution. A man who would grant any wish. His name? Master, Master Mirror. Mirror. The rest okay. follows naturally. Olgird and Odin meet him at a crossroads. A wish. A pact signed in blood. And a price to be paid. Olgird was to sacrifice one he loved. Old Dim delights in difficult choices. He knew Olgird loved two in this world. His betrothed and his brother, Vladimir. Olgird chose, and soon thereafter married his beloved Iris. His fortune restored. Okay, Vladimir, did Olgird kill him? So did Olgird kill his own brother? No, no, no. Deduce, Witcher. Odim acts directly or indirectly. Hmm? Olgird merely signed the blood letter. The next day, his brother was dead. Okay, so that's everything gets more interesting. I mean, we got like some information about like that master mirror or whatever you want to call that dude, but whatever, let's keep asking that dude because he's pretty damn interesting and I do not regret speaking to him. Olgird tell you all that? He had to. How else was I to diagnose his case? Make it sound like an illness. It is worse. Many illnesses are treatable. But play with evil, medicine can be much harder to find. Olgird wanted to break his pact. Why? Why was Olgird out to get rid of Odim? He'd gotten what he wanted. Had he? <laughs> his heart had turned cold as ice. His feelings for his wife, for whom he'd sacrificed his brother, had withered. He'd lost all he loved. Had he wanted any of this? No. Odim grants what you wish, not what you want. All who sign a pact learn the difference and die by it. Oh, no way to get rid of him? Kill him, you mean? Kill evil? <laughs> no. Yet the annals tell of a man who dissolved his pact by defeating Odim at his own game. Meaning? Ogdim wheels contracts, word traps, duels of wits. Challenge him to such a duel. He'll agree, and can be beaten. But remember, there is only ever one stake. Sole thing he truly desires. Human souls. How can I get rid of this mark? Ogdim left a mark on my face. Any way to get it off? A mark? No mention in the tomes. Strange. Unless... Unless it will disappear once your pact is fulfilled. If I challenge him, end the pact that way, will it go away? That I do not know. The one man who succeeded bore no mark. Okay, thanks for your help. Actually, I'm really glad that I talked to him because now at least I get to know more Olgird and Master Mirror and everything. Great. Thanks helped me a lot. Good. Very good. Ah, oh, to feel useful after so many years locked up, living in fear. Why, it's pleasance itself. Fucking shit, he left the circle and he died. Everything looks like an accident, but it's not. Okay, whatever, you know what I think. Fucking shit, key to professor's house. Oh yeah, now I'm be I'll be able to get out. Great, but that's like really fucking weird. Poor dude, I don't want him to die, but whatever. He just left the circle and he died. Everything is so cool. Can I like, unlock this, it's unlocked. I still love the game, everything is great. Actually, I feel what I need to feel. I feel happy, right? I feel like I'm really driven into this game. I really want to know what's gonna happen and that's what game is supposed to be. I'm just thrilled to know what's gonna happen at the end. I don't care about the characters, like about Olgierd, about that dude. There is no like much feelings involved in the characters, but what I do care is 
how everything is gonna end, you know? I'm really interested who the fuck are they. So will I be able to get out of here through this? Yep, I guess I will jump there in the river. Why he didn't jump on his head? That would be cooler. Okay, let's get there and I guess as soon as I'm closer I will end the episode because yeah, I thought I will end this game in one episode but maybe it's gonna take a little bit longer. Maybe no. Yeah, let's find the closest traveling point. Let's get back there. Okay, and I think I will talk more about the game at the end of the game, what I think about it. Actually, I still think the DLC is great. The only thing, you know, what I didn't like. Not like what I didn't like, but that's, like, stood out compared to other things in this game. Like, actually, everything is really great. Like, everything, I think, is 10 out of 10 except the wedding. Wedding are, like, 8, 9 out of 10, you know. Weddings were, like, a little bit too long. They could add in a little bit more. Something more involving. I don't know. Because it's like in the beginning of the game as soon as we play we want to like be with shiny You know not like be with shiny, but we just want to talk with shiny We don't want anyone else to talk to her and like Vladimir like possesses us so that means that Vladimir is talking to her and Actually, you don't really want Vladimir to hook up with shiny so you but you don't have any choice the game leads to this like, the only thing you can do is to talk to Shiny, but you don't want to talk to her because you want to leave Shiny for a girl. So that's why the wedding wasn't perfect, because because of that twist, you know, and I guess you agree with me because... Yeah, so thank you for watching this video, really appreciate it. If you liked it, just hit the like button. If you want to see more, don't forget to subscribe. So bye-bye. Bye-bye.